Hello everybody, we're here at Thousand Islands Toyota and today we're looking at the 2020 Toyota RAV4 Limited all-wheel drive. This vehicle comes with a 2.5 liter four-cylinder engine. Also combined with the electric motor, produces 219 horsepower and 221 foot-pounds of torque. It also comes with a massive variety of safety features from Toyota Safety Sense and comes with a beautiful set of 18-inch alloy wheels. There's a lot that the uh, Limited offers here, and as I stated, this is all-wheel drive, so really, really nice to have during the winter months as well. Let's take a look on the inside. All right, so here we are on the passenger side. And as you can see, we have a gorgeous interior here with the mixed soft text and leather seats. We have a good, nice combination there. Beautiful stitching on the inside as well. So nice use of the browns with the black and the silver. Everything looks outstanding. These seats, uh, of course, are heated and ventilated, and the driver's side has uh, eight-way power adjustable as well. Driver's or passenger seat, sorry, is uh, manual adjustable. And then here in the back. Our passengers are not left out. We've got the uh, vents in the back as well so they can enjoy the heat or cool. We've also got two USB charging ports there. We have an armrest slash cup holder hidden in there. And they also get heated seats in the back. So definitely a nice variety of features uh, on the limited trim for sure. All right. And here we have the power lift gate. There, this also does come with a kick sensor, which is really nice. So if your hands are full, just put your foot underneath the bumper there and uh, the tailgate will open up for you. As you can see, we do also have the uh, upgraded JBL sound system in here. We've got a nice spacious trunk here as well that does come with 60-40 uh, split seats in the back so you can fold them down. They go down almost all the way so you have lots more space. And it also does come with the tunnel cover. So uh, if you prefer that your personal belongings are uh, stored privately, you can just pull that back. It'll clip right into the back here, no problem, very easy. And then we do also have two additional sets of mats for the different seasons. That way the uh, wrap always stays nice and clean as well. And there is also a button up top here. If you press that, it will close as well. You can also adjust the height uh, for, for how, uh, how far you'd like the actual tailgate to open. If you'd like it to open a little bit lower, you know, depending on your height, that's possible too to adjust inside the vehicle. All right, and here we are in the driver's seat. As you can see, we've got a really nice uh, set of gauges with the multi-information display in front of us. This contains a lot of information, a lot of settings that can be adjusted uh, via the directional pad in the back button there. So all you need to do is press left or right. Just quickly show you guys a lot. <laughs> There's a lot of different stuff in here that you guys can access, especially if you wanna know or learn more about the vehicle. A lot of your uh, Toyota Safety Sense settings here. Uh, this, like I said, comes with a large variety. It has uh, obviously a backup camera, but it's got the uh, bird's eye view, uh, 360 panoramic view. So uh, you can basically see around the vehicle. Uh, plus you have your sensors. So if you come close to touching something, um, you know, it'll beep and it'll progressively beep faster and faster until you're basically, you know, directly in front of that object. So uh, that's really nice to have, especially if you're just, you know, getting used to a vehicle and, and learning its size and such. Uh, at the same time, we also have any safety alerts that pop up there too, which is really nice. And then we do have the audio and Bluetooth controls via the steering wheel, along with our cruise control settings and then a couple of our safety sense settings there like the uh, dynamic radar cruise control, which is full speed. And uh, we also do have the lane tracing assist as well. And down below there, it might be a little bit harder to see, uh, but we do have the uh, power lift gate, our heated steering wheel, the uh, rear view camera mirror, um, and we also do have the wiper de-icers and the auto high beams. And then we move over to our eight inch uh, multi-information touchscreen. Uh, this is a really nice layout. 
I also played around the settings a little bit. So as you can see, this is actually red, uh, which is a preference of mine. I think it looks really neat. And I like the option that you can play around with the color settings too, um, especially if you prefer one, uh, you know, specifically for night driving over another uh, or just a favorite color. So we do have the physical buttons and knobs here on both sides, but as I said before, this is also a touchscreen. Uh, we've got a ton of different sources here. We've got AM, FM, Sirius XM, USB, Bluetooth. Uh, it is Android Auto and Apple CarPlay compatible as well. And uh, you can really take advantage of that with the upgraded JBL sound system there. So this also does have the 11 speaker system. Uh, so it definitely pumps out a good amount of sound. And then we have our climate control settings. Really nice, really easy to use. Really like that Toyota stuck with the knobs here. And they have like a rubberized kind of coating, which feels really nice, uh, pleasantly to the touch. It's very easy to uh, just quickly scroll over. It's very grippy, which is really nice. And then, as I stated earlier, uh, both the seats in the front are heated and ventilated. We also have our traction control, and then we've got the uh, USB for your USB audio or your Android Auto and Apple CarPlay, as well as a power inverter there. Then we do also have the uh, wireless charging Qi system there. So all you have to do is, if your phone allows it, if it's a newer phone, you can place your phone on there and it'll charge it up for you wirelessly, which is really nice while you're driving. Uh, for anyone that hasn't seen the S or has has sorry hasn't seen this yet or is new to this, uh, this is the parking brake, so it's no longer a stick. Uh, it's simply a button. And if you want to learn more about that, then uh, I you know ask one of the uh, salespeople, uh, and they'll definitely help you out. We've got a really nice leather wrap shifter. Uh, we also do have a, a couple different uh, drive modes here as well, including the EV mode, which is electric vehicle mode. Then we've got our cup holders. We've got two, two more USB charging ports in there as well, plus a tray that can be uh, removed and quite a bit of space underneath there as well. So all in all, uh, the RAV4 Limited does come with quite a uh, variety of options. This also does have a power moonroof uh, and it does include uh, memory seats as well up to two. So there you have it folks, there's the 2020 Toyota RAV4 Hybrid Limited All-Wheel Drive. Uh, this is a fantastic vehicle in general. It comes with a boatload of uh, driver assistance features, safety features, uh, as well as comfort features on the interior uh, with great fuel efficiency and the reliability of a Toyota. Uh, at the end of the day, this is one of the best vehicles in its class. And it's something you guys should come check out at Thousand Islands Toyota. So come on down and let us help you find the vehicle that you're looking for.